Hello, people. Good evening. Hello, Domingo. Hello, teacher. Hello, Hi, teacher. How are you? How was your day? Good. It was good. Okay. I'm happy for you. Are you working tomorrow or not? No. Okay, that's good. Me neither. <laughs> Hello, Marco. Hello, teacher. Who are you? I'm good, and you? Are you tired? Yeah, I work this day too. <laughs> And are you going to work tomorrow or not? Uh, tomorrow, um, Sunday, Sunday, uh, work or extra? Extra hours. Yeah, extra hours. And beginning my, mi turno, no me acuerdo como me dijo la vez pasada. My shift. Ah, my shift, um, Monday. Okay. Mm -hmm. Marquito. Marquito. Hello, Marquito. Hello. 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 All right. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to start taking the attendance. So please remember to suppress it over here. So let's begin with Alba Vides. Are you here tonight? This evening? Maybe yes, maybe not. No. <laughs> okay, Alfredo Alexander? Present. Carla Maritza Sánchez. Present. Carlos Gualberto. Cristina Romero. Domingo González. Present. Fátima Portillo. José Matías Lemus. Karina. Present, 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 teacher. Sorry. <laughs> Voy okay. llegando a trabajar, teacher. Ok. Karina Yamile Espinosa. Marco David Velázquez Vázquez. Present. Marlon Alberto Cardona Valencia. Present. Mauricio Majano. Maideli Judith. Ok. She's oyente. Wait a moment, guys. Wait a moment. Bon appetit, Matias. Nancy Rodriguez. Present teacher. Rocío Martínez, Maito Calle. Present teacher. Salvador Escobar. Sandra Velázquez. Present. Víctor Salazar. Present. Walter González. Walter, no? William Perez. Okay, Carlos Walberto says present. Present, okay, that's good. That's good. That's Esto good. es lo que encontré. That's good. That's good. My crazy phone. Okay, thank you so much. Now, guys, I'm going to the screen so that you can see the presentation.
Let me know when you can see it. Can you see my presentation? Yes, teacher. Okay, that's good. Well, today is Friday, August 27th. Yes, guys, and it's the video conference number 17. That means that we are just missing three more video conferences. Aha, uh -huh. the video conferences, um, yeah, we, we are missing three, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. That means that the course is going to finish on Wednesday, September 1st. That means that you have to finish all the homework by Monday and Tuesday, and also the exam, the exam, you have the final exam, you have to take it before the last video conference, okay? So don't forget that, please. Okay. Very good. So we are working on Unit 4 about travel plans. That's why yesterday we were talking about hotel services and amenities. And today's topic is how to use be going to. We use this structure to talk about the future. Okay, be going to to talk about the future. So let's start with the class objective. And can Domingo, could you please read the class objective? The class will be a real use, be going to. To tell about future, future travel, travel plans. Travel plans and hotel reservations. Okay, hotel reservations. Thank you so much. Hotel and this, we have the agenda. Um, let me see. Nancy, could you please read the activities that we have in the agenda? Nancy. Agenda. And what would me plan for the weekend? Activate one for the play. Activate two. Home to use the go to. Activate three. Uh, practice. Good. Put your brain to work. Put. Good. You brain to work. Activity four. Tai. ¿Cómo se dice time? Time. Tai to work in par. In pairs. Okay. Thank you so much. And finally, the wrap up, which is your favorite activity. <laughs> Okay, so let's start. Mm -hmm. The warm up plans for the weekend. I have some questions here, guys. So um, you are going to be in the breakout rooms, and you are going to ask and answer questions about your plans for the weekend. It's Friday, so you maybe you have idea of what you are going to do this weekend, this coming weekend. So, um, for example, you are going to ask, are you going to meet your friends? Are you going to visit your relatives? Are you going to go to the beach? Are you going to have a barbecue? Are you going to work? Are you going to wash your pet? I mean, dog or cat or whatever you have. Are you going to eat out? Are you going to do homework? Are you going to sleep till late? Okay, so you're going to answer your um, to your partner, right? But <coughs> I'm sorry. You cannot say yes, I am or no, I'm not. You cannot say that. You it's forbidden to say yes and it's forbidden to say no. You cannot say yes. You cannot say no. You have to use all the words. If you say yes. Or if you say no, you're going to have a penalty. You are going to have a penalty, okay? So it's like a game. It's a game, a dynamic. 
what answers can you have? What answers can you use? You can say, for example, are you going to meet your friends? Maybe. Are you going to go to the beach? Mm, I'm not sure. Uh, are you going to work? Uh, that's false. Are you going to eat at? Eat out, it's a possibility. Are you going to do homework? Absolutely, teacher, absolutely. Are you going to sleep till late? Sure. So those are like some answers that you can give instead of saying yes or no. Okay, so this is, these are the questions for the first student, student A, or student one, and these are, and the other one I have for student B. Are you going to do the laundry? Are you going to watch a movie? Are you going to clean your house? Are you going to paint your house? Are you going to cook something special? Are you going to eat pupusas? Of course, teacher. Are you going to play video games? Are you going to wash your car? Are you going to watch a movie or TV program? And the possible answers. Sure, of course, maybe, perhaps, absolutely, certainly, that's true, that's false, that's right, definitely, I think so, I'm not sure, it's a possibility, I'm afraid I, I can't, I like to, but, and you can give another answer i wish i could but unfortunately i so you can um give other answers other answers but don't say yes and don't say no doesn't if no sé si tienen preguntas if you have any questions about these words these phrases preguntas sobre estas expresiones teacher the rain very hard it's raining very hard. Yeah. No, listen. You can't listen. Don't you have some earphones? Can you put some earphones? Yes. Okay. En el cerebro lo tengo ya, teacher. Okay. Vaya. Okay. En... Casi no entendí mucho. O sea, okay. cuando usted dice, cuando, vaya, yo le entiendo lo que, lo que lo, al traducirlo, va. <coughs> por, el, por ejemplo, are you going to watch a movie? Yo sé que le está diciendo que si puede ir a ver una película. No, le está preguntando que si va a ver una película el fin de semana. Estamos hablando de los planes para el fin de semana. Teacher, ah, ya, 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 ya. Plan for the weekend. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo pregunto? Es como que te digan, vas a ir a ver una película, algo así. <risa> Perdón, Domingo, casi no se le entendió, sí. pero... Pero sí, esa es, vea. Vas a, la, vas, a hacer la, la, vas a hacer la lavandería, va a lavar la ropa, va a ver una película, vas a limpiar tu casa, va a pintar su casa, va a cocinar algo especial, va a comer pupusas, vas a, ver, vas a jugar videojuegos, va a lavar su carro... Va a haber una película o un programa de televisión el fin de semana. Sí, pero no, no... Are you, are you going? Es solo el va. Ajá, es para el futuro. Mm, uh -huh. Ok, ok. Vale, entonces, um, no puede decir yes y no puede decir no. no es, es, así es la dinámica, ¿verdad? Que ah. está prohibido decir yes and it's forbidden to say no. It's forbidden. Okay. You have to use other words, other expressions, y, and this is the list. Aquí hay una lista, ¿verdad? De, de otras alternativas, another alternatives for yes and no. For example, sure, seguro, of course, por supuesto, maybe, tal vez, perhaps, tal vez, absolutely, absolutamente, sí, eh, certainly, ciertamente, ¿verdad? That's true, eso es cierto. O that's false, eso es falso, no es cierto. That's right, es correcto. Definitely, definitivamente, I think so, yo creo que sí. 
I'm not sure, no estoy seguro. It's a possibility, es una posibilidad. I'm afraid I can't, creo, temo que no podré o que no puedo. I would like to, but I have to. Me gustaría, pero tengo que. Y luego menciona algo, ¿verdad? I wish I could, but... Eh, desearía poder, pero tengo que... Ahí tiene que mencionar algo, ¿verdad? Unfortunately, I... Desafortunadamente, I... Y ahí luego dice algo, ¿verdad? Sobre usted. Are you ready, guys? ¿Están listos, chicos? No. <laughs> Yo esperaba que me dijeran, sí, capitán, estamos listos. <risa> no. ¿Y por qué no? Why not? Vaya, si gustan, repitan después de mí las, ex, las, ex, las expresiones, las answers. Pueden usar cualquiera de estas para responder, para solo que no pueden decir yes. Y no pueden decir no. ¿Ok? I can say of course. Or yes, sure. Yes. Estas um, sí las pueden decir. Por eso se las he puesto acá. ¿Verdad? Ok, repeat after me. Let's practice pronunciation. All right. Sure. Sure. Of course. Of course. Maybe. Maybe. Perhaps. Perhaps. Absolutely. Absolutely. Certainly. 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 That's true. That's true. That's false. That's false. That's right. That's right. Definitely. Definitely. I think so. I think so. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. It's a possibility. It's a possibility. Possibility. Yes, or... yes it's a possibility. possibility. I'm afraid I can't. I'm afraid. I'm afraid. Afraid. I can't. I like to, but I have to. I like to, but I have to. I wish I could, but. I wish I could, but. Unfortunately. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. Unfortunately. Very good. And now, guys, are you ready? Go ahead. <laughs> Absolutely. Excellent. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yes, teacher. Okay. Of course. Of you course. say yes. You Ooh. say yes. Yeah, but I am the teacher. No the problem. The possibility. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good, Marlon. Marlon is practicing very well. Okay, take a screenshot, please. Yeah. Ready? A student Ready. one, take a screenshot. A student two, take a screenshot. Okay. Okay, now. Mm, I have a chat. Oh. Very good. So, yeah, let's go in the groups. In the group.
dijo la Again. Good evening. <laughs> Hello, guys. Do you, I mean, are the instructions clear for the activity? Muchas gracias. Preguntas que estaban allí. Las vamos a contestar nosotros o vamos a hacer el traslado. No, esas, esas son las que van a preguntar. Ah, ok. Solo, solo. En, en este grupo nada más, lo que tenemos en este grupo. ¿Cómo así? De, de las questions. Uh -huh. De las questions. Is... Vale. Van, a, van a hacerle las preguntas aquí, ¿verdad? A, a Karina y a Nancy. Usted le pregunta a Karina y a Nancy. Y luego, yo aquí, aquí hay tres, ¿verdad? En algunos hay solo dos, pero... Do, two students. Pero aquí se, se, se hacen las preguntas y no tiene que responder yes ni tampoco puede decir no. Tiene que usar las otras expresiones que están ahí de acuerdo a lo que va a hacer el fin de semana. Si quiere, Domingo, let's practice and you can ask me some questions and I will show you how. Uh, are you going to wash your bed or cat? That's false. I don't have a dog and I don't have a cat. <laughs> No, y su respuesta. No. I said that's false. Ah, that's false. It's false because I don't have a dog and I don't have a cat, so I don't have to watch them. Okay. Teacher, yo tengo una pregunta. Yes, tell me. Una pregunta, sino que tengo un inconveniente. No puedo, no tomé captura, no como estoy utilizando el teléfono. No tengo otro teléfono para, para ver la información. Ah, mmm. Ok. Yo voy a hacer la mando al chat, Karina, y está así como Al chat de, de aquí, ¿verdad? Vaya. Vale. Ahorita se las voy a enviar aquí. No me preocupes, a mí sí. there's always a solution for any problem you have. Okay. Thank you for the suggestion, Nancy. Okay, so you have the possible answer there, Karina. Quiero escucharlos. I want to listen to you practicing, okay? I'm going to stay here for a, for a while. Just ignore me, please. Okay, can you go? Domingo, listo. Yeah. No, no. Ok, haga su pregunta. Cualquiera, ahí van. Are you going to watch a movie or TV program? Uh, movie. Is a possibility. Me escuché bien. Puedo cambiar de teléfono. Okay, Karina. Hola, no puedo ver. Lo que pasa es que, hola, no puedo ver. Solo veo lo que me mandaron, pero de las 
Preguntas, pero no puedo ver la, la ¿cómo se llama? Creo que esa es una la respuesta, pero las la preguntas pregunta. no las puedo ver. Si gusta, se los voy a mandar a Lo WhatsApp. que pasa es que el teléfono, el teléfono, lo que pasa es que el teléfono lo estoy usando así con el video y no puedo entrar al WhatsApp. No puedo entrarlo. No, no puedo. Or you can turn off, you can turn off your, your video. Puede apagar la cámara. Ah, teacher, así estoy yo. Ajá, puede apagar la cámara para que pueda ver las preguntas. Bueno. Vaya, hoy sí. Ya. Hoy sí. Me puede escuchar. Are you going to what your car? I use possibly. Possibly. Vaya, chicos. No sé si no les sé. he también algunas preguntas. ¿Cómo? Les envío también algunas preguntas. No sé, para que las mire ahí. Pero siempre van a ser las mismas que están en, en la cultura, he dicho. Sí, las mismas. Va, y le mandé algunas para que las pregunte Karina. Y no sé por qué, pero yo me escucho cuando hablo. Me, me escucho. No sé por qué será ese problema. Mm. Ya, es el... Y quiero ver ahora, ay, ahora ya no me escucho. Es que me escucho ahí con como con Nancy. Mm. No sé cuál será el problema. Vale, pero ya, ya entienden. Perdón, Nancy. Pero ya entienden cómo va la dinámica. Sí, he una consulta. Este, más o menos, no sé si, si me equivoco, pero aquí están las respuestas y a la par están la, la, perdón, aquí están las preguntas y a la par están las respuestas. ¿O no es así? Sí, así, sí. O sea, usted le hace una pregunta y depende de si lo va a hacer o no lo va a hacer, va a contestar. Ah, bueno. Ajá, por ejemplo, si yo le pregunto, Karina, are you going to work this weekend? ¿Va a trabajar este fin de semana? Are you going to work? Are you going to work this weekend? Uh, sería, I is possibility. It's a possibility. It's a possibility. Ajá. O sea, que es posible que trabaje. Yes. Ok, entonces usted dice, it's a possibility. O puede usar otra de las respuestas que están ahí, dependiendo, ¿verdad? Ah, bueno. Ok. Vale, ¿ya los puedo dejar para chequear otro, ayudar a otro grupo?
Yes, teacher. Okay, all right. Okay, Doki. Okay, please practice. Yes. Is the last part of? No. Um, that... You are referring to the the first one. It's um the homework. Seventeen. Hi, teacher. Hello. Oh, Hi, you teacher. are doing your homework. Yeah, we talk about the. Uh, I don't. I don't understand. <laughs> but I don't know if he is maybe the final exam for the unit four travel plans. Yeah, because the instruction. Say complete the sentence using the form of B plus going to plus verb in bracket. In the bracket. Is this is this bracket. one right? Is this this class? Yes, this class. Yeah. This class, all right. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm going to do the, the first one. He is going. He's going to form. The, the homework 16, it's okay. The 17 is the problem. <laughs> yeah, but you are going to study the, this class. Yeah. In this class. In Just this... be a little bit patient. All right. Okay, right. Did, you, did you do the activity of asking? Yeah, yeah. Okay. We, uh, we practice with Marlon. William is hearing okay um, we have finished good good okay i i will give you i mean more time because i was with another group and they had problems so uh, yeah. they had just started practicing i want them to practice more okay but All if right. you are doing the homework i mean that's great because you are taking advantage of the time as you notice marco eh, when the structure is B, the verb B forms. There are three forms of the verb B. Am, is, and are. I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, we are, and they are. Then you use going to, and then the verb in the base form, for example. I am going to visit my mother. I'm going to do the laundry this weekend. I have a lot of clothes to, to wash. Um, I'm going to clean my house this weekend. Okay? I'm not going to work this weekend. Um, I'm not going to go to the beach this weekend. Okay? So I'm not going to go to the beach. She is not going to work. Are you going to work this weekend? Yes, I'm going to work. Okay, the answer is very short. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Okay. That's it. That's but in this activity, I mean, the dynamic was not saying yes and not saying no, right? So. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Just let me check another group. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, people. Did you finish practicing? Nothing, teacher. Only, only that. <laughs> oh, is Sandra? In Alfredo? Not even by know. chat? I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna ask you some questions. Matias, are you going to are you going to play video games this weekend? Uh, never. Never play never. Video. <laughs> yeah. You are a liar. Okay. <laughs> Are you going to cook something special this weekend? 
and visit my awesome. No, 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 no. I told you. Uh, my question was, are you going to cook something special this weekend? Maybe? Perhaps? Uh, it's a possibility. I don't understand. Are you going to cook? Cook. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Are you going to cook? R rustic, like a chef. Rustic chicken. Oh, really? So you're going to yes. have like a barbecue? No, rustic. Only rustic. Nice. Okay. Yes. Matias, are you going to take a shower this weekend? Take a shower. Yes, take a shower with shampoo and soap and yes, water. Yes, yes. I'm sorry? And... No. <laughs> ah, you say yes and you say no. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Yeah. Ah, okay, sure. Oh, definitely, of course, teacher. <laughs> okay, thank you, Matias. Okay, teach. Take a shower. Necesita un coffee, teacher. I already <laughs> had a cup of coffee, believe me. Yes. <laughs> okay. Oh, Rocio is at home now. She was driving, but now she's at home and very comfortable. Okay. So, how was the practice? How was the activity? Nice, teacher. Okay. I'm going to ask some people. Let me see. Teacher, teacher, I have a question. Yes, Rocio? Maybe it's the same to say. Perhaps. It's the same. The same? Yes. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Marlon. Hi, Marlon. You turn off your camera. Marlon, are you going to take a shower this weekend? It, it's a possibility, teacher. <laughs> if you have water, you're going to take it. But if there's no water, you're not. <laughs> I'm Just afraid. Kidding. <laughs> okay, Carlos Walberto, are you going to work this weekend? Unfortunately, I had to go with my family uh, out. <laughs> ah, so you're not working. Okay, okay, good. Domingo, are you going to do the laundry this weekend? Wash your clothes. Do the laundry, Domingo, you, yes? Domingo, you are muted. Yep. Domingo. In the sleep. Ah, okay. <laughs> what, well, excuse me? Hey, Domingo, are you, going, are you going to do the laundry? This weekend? Laundry. Yeah, wash your clothes, wash your clothes, your clothes, wash. Ah. Uh, I know, I am not sure. <laughs> you are not sure, okay. Marco David. <laughs> Tell me. Are you going to do homework this weekend? Of course. Ah, I okay. To, I, need, okay. I need to end the, the, the platform. The platform, okay. Rocio <laughs> Martinez, are you going to wash your car? That's right, teacher. Okay, good. Walter Daniel, are you going to have a barbecue this weekend? Sure. 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 Okay. <laughs> Very good. Thank you guys for your participation.
Okay, let's continue with the next activity. This was a little bit long, but it's important because you practice. Now, there is another conversation over here between um, a, a person who is calling to a hotel, okay, to make a reservation. So please listen to me. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen, how can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay, good. So I would like to have two volunteers to, um, to practice the conversation in front of the class. Me. Okay, one is? Me too. Okay, Rocio and who, who said me? Matias or who? Yes. Okay, Rocio, you start, you are Jan, and Matias, you are Gerardo. Okay, hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen, how can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I am Matias Lemus. Thank you, Mr. Lemus. When are you going to arrive? I am going to arrive on Friday uh, 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Uh, ah. Lemus? <laughs> uh, I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? Uh, single room, please. Okay. Thank you. Excellent. Great job, guys. Okay, any other couple of volunteers? Any other couple of volunteers? I need to. Carlos, Carlos Walberto. <laughs> no, teacher. Okay. Okay, teacher. Hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? Hello. I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Carlos Rodriguez. Thank you, Mr. Rodriguez. Rodriguez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Rodriguez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make a reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Excellent! Bravo, bravo! <laughs> okay, and the la this is the last opportunity for you to um, practice in front of the class. Do we have another couple of students? Okay, Marlon and Walter teacher. Walter is not there. Okay, Marlon and Walter, creo que dijeron. Ponga Marco teacher. <laughs> Volunteers. Volunteers. It's okay, teacher. It's okay. Okay, Marco. You start. Yeah. I I'm start. All right. Um let me see. Um uh, hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Marco. Okay. Oh. How can I help you? 
Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Marlon Cardona. Thank you, Mr. Cardona. Where are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Senor Cardona or Mr. Cardona? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for single or double room? A single room, please. Maybe we can change later. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, guys, nice. Thank nice. you so much. Nice. Very good. I think you sent. Okay, there's a message on the chat. Okay. <laughs> Call center style, Marlon. Good. Now I fill the form with information from the conversation and compare your answers. Oops, sorry. For example, the hotel, the Golden Star Hotel reservation form. Agent. What's the agent's name? Do you remember? Yeah. Jen. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yes. The guest. Eh, Gerardo. Gerardo. Yes. Check in. Check in. Uh, check in. When is the check in? When is he going to arrive to the hotel? Friday 14th. Friday 14th. And when is he going to leave? Uh, Monday. Monday? Friday, I mean 15th, 17th, right? Is it single room or double single. room? Single room. Single room. Okay. Now, when you make a hotel reservation, you can use would like for a very polite request. Would you like? Would you like a single room or a double room? Okay, so would like, I would like air conditioning in my room. I would like cable TV service in my room. Okay, so would like is to, it's a very polite request or petition, okay? A very polite petition or request. Wi-Fi. Okay. Okay, Wi-Fi service, yeah, that's important, very important. Okay. Minibar. A minibar, yes, of course, <laughs> very cool, of course. Yeah, for men, that's so important. Okay, good. So need and want are also possible uh, ways that you can use to ask for a request, but it's not as polite as would like. It's less polite, it's less formal. Mm -hmm. You can say, I would like to make a reservation, or you can say, I need to make a reservation, or I want to make a reservation. But if you want to be very polite and very formal, you're going to use? I would like to make, I would like, I would like. I would like, I would like that my students participate all the time, okay? I need that my students complete the homework. I want my students to speak English all the time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it is a request, but um, um, in, in the polite way is would like, okay? Okay. Good, what is next? Okay, the use of be going to. The structure, well, before we, See that we have these examples. I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. I'm going to stay until Monday. Mrs. Puentes is going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Negative sentences. Mrs. Puentes is not going to fly to Cuba on the 14th. Mr. Gomez is not going to arrive on Thursday 13th, okay? Yes. So as you can see, we use be going to for future plans to talk about the future. But 
it's planned actions about planned actions in the future so it's already a plan for example we are going to sing at the party it's already i mean you have plans yeah it's a plan verdad Está planificado de you are going to sing at the party in the karaoke. Okay? You are certain, you are sure that something is going to happen in the future because there is a logical consequence. Look at that car, it is going to crash into the yellow one. So you have evidence that that's going to happen. Hay evidencia de que eso va a pasar efectivamente. Okay. Ahora, ¿cómo lo utilizamos? Bueno, usamos la forma del verbo be dependiendo de el sujeto, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, I, ¿cuál es la forma del verbo be que uso? Um. I am. Yes. You are. Are. He is. Is. She is. Is it? Is. Is. We? Are. You? Are. They? Are. Ok, ok. Y luego, going to, and then the verb. The verb is going to be always in the base form. Mm -hmm. And we use it to describe a schedule activities and activities that will definitely happen in the future. And for negative sentences, you just have to add not before going to. I'm not going to wash my car to speak. Um, Carlos is not going to have English classes this weekend. Marco is going to work this weekend. Marlon is not going to take a shower this weekend. Domingo is going to do his laundry. Okay. Y aquí lo tenemos más ejemplos, more examples. When, uh, the form of the verb to be, am, um, are, or is, plus going to, plus infinitive. And I have these examples. The long forms and contracted forms. I am going to play handball. I'm going, I'm going to play, to play handball. handball. You are going to play handball. You're going to play handball. Negative sentences. I am not going to play handball. I'm not going to play handball. You are not going to play handball. You're not going to play handball or you aren't going to play handball. And you can see this, the children playing handball. It's like football, but with your hands. Teacher, one question. Mm -hmm. Tell me, please. Okay. And y, en terceras personas, e igual, igualito, igualito. They are not going to play handball. Hand, hand, Handball. Tercera persona plural, sí. Tercera persona singular es. He's not. He, he's, he's going to play handball. She is going to play handball. She's mm. not going to play handball. He isn't going to play handball. Okay. Okay, okay. Please participate because if not, I'm going to fall asleep. Okay, just no questions. For just no questions, the only thing we have to do is to change the position of the verb be. Solo le damos vuelta, si ve. En vez de decir, you are going are, to make a reservation, you? le va a dar vuelta, vea. Y le va a poner, are you? Teacher. Are you going to stay in a smoking or not a smoking room? Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? Dígame, Matías. Es igual que cuando se utiliza, se aprende a utilizar el verbo to be, ¿verdad? Sí, lo está utilizando el verbo to be. Uh -huh. Solo que no, vamos pero, a agregar to. el going to. 
Okay. Are you going to stay in the smoking or not smoking room? Okay, miren. Igual, ¿verdad? Sería Igual. con is. Is Matías going to play video games after class? Yes. Yes, he is. Okay, or no, he's not. Or oh, sure. Sure. <laughs> sure. Okay, is the teacher going to sleep after the class? Yes, every day. <laughs> or before the class. <laughs> or in the class. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Muy bien. <laughs> Ahora, information questions. For information questions, solo agregamos el question word at the beginning of the question. Al principio de la pregunta ponemos the question word. Do you remember what the questions were are? Who, what, when, where? No le escuché nada. Last question words for information questions. Mm. What, where, when, where, when, how, which, who, who, who why. Mm -hmm. And we have this example. How long are you going to stay? Mm. ¿Cuánto tiempo se va a quedar? When are you going to arrive? ¿Cuándo va a venir? ¿Cuándo va a llegar? Mm -hmm. Muy bien. Veamos aquí. To ask yes no questions about schedule activities, begin with the verb being plus the subject plus going to plus the verb. For information questions, just place the WH word phrase at the beginning of the question and continue like you would do for a yes no question. Entonces, es bien fácil. Miren, para hacer la yes, la yes no question, ponen el verbo to be al principio. Luego el sujeto. Y luego el going to y el verbo base. Para las information questions, seguimos la misma estructura con la única diferencia que ponemos la question word al inicio. Al inicio de la pregunta y luego sigue la misma estructura que las yes no questions. Muy bien, ahora es time to practice. Are you ready? Maybe, perhaps. Definitely. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Absolutely, definitely, certainly, of course. Veamos, igual, más, more examples. With just no questions. Auxiliary, subject, going to, verb, and the complement or the rest. Uh, okay, are you going to watch TV tonight? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is Hilary going to read a book over the weekend? Yes, she is. No, she's not. No, she isn't. Questions with question words in the going to future. Question word, auxiliary, subject, going to, verb, complement, answer. Where are you going to spend your holidays? I'm going to spend my holidays in my parents' house. What is Frank going to have for dinner? He's going to have some pupusas. Use is with the third person singular. He, she, it. I'm with the first person singular. I. And in all other persons are. You are, we are, they are. Use going to and definitive after the subject in all persons. Okay, guys, do you have any questions before the practice? Any questions? No questions? No question. Okay. No questions. 
I am printing to page. Okay, so, oh, guys, before the practice, I will take the attendance. So please say present or here. say here, exactly. Excuse me. Alba Vides? Alfredo? Present. Carla Maritza? Present. Carlos Gualberto? Present. <laughs> Very happy, Carlos. Cristina Romero? Oh, Cristina is not in the class. Domingo. Present. Fatima. Present teacher. Jose Lemus. Here. Karina. Present. Marco. Present. Marlon. Present. Mauricio. Maideli. Present. Nancy. Present. Rocío. Present teacher. Salvador. Y Salvador. No. Um, Sandra. Present. Victor. Present. Walter. Present. William. Ah, está como oyente. Y ya vi que ya vino Alba. Alba Dinora. Ahí está de oyente. Ok. Muy bien, chicos. Entonces, now you are going to practice your, your, going, your knowledge. You're going to put it into practice. You're going to apply what you learn. We have this exercise in which you have to order the words to create sentences and questions about the schedule activities. Please write the questions on the chat. In the chat. Please, I will be reading you. Alfredo says, you are going to Okay, the number, the no, what about the number one? When are you going to leave to Dallas? Let's do it. Okay. When are you going to arrive to Dallas? When are you going to arrive to Dallas? Okay. Number two, Alfredo dice, you are going to make a reservation for the conference room. Very good, Fatima. When are you going to arrive to Dallas? I'm going to wake up for. Write it on the chat. Write it on the chat. Uh huh. I'm going to request for a wake up call at for a 5 a.m. wake up call. Teacher. Yeah. Number five. Uh, yes. No. No, I have subject. Oh, yeah, yeah. 
Number four, Mrs. Turcios is going to check out tomorrow. Excellent. And then number three, nadie me la puso, ¿verdad? No le dije. I'm sorry, I just... Are you going to make a reservation for the conference room? Okay. Mrs. Diaz is going to need another smoking room. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Number three. I'm going to make, I'm going to request. Excellent, Alfredo. <laughs> Very good, guys. Thank you. Okay, let's continue with the next activity. Okay, let's put your brain to work, guys. Yes, let's make your brain exercise. Okay, look at my example. In my example, I have my mom is going to visit me tomorrow. X and D, affirmative, negative, or interrogative form? Affirmative. Affirmative. So, if my sentence is in affirmative, I'm going to change it. I'm going to uh -huh, put it in the negative form. For example, my mom is not going to visit me tomorrow. Then, I'm going to make a yes no question. For example, is my mom going to visit me tomorrow? And then I'm going to also create a WH question or information question. For example, what time is my mom going to visit me tomorrow? ¿Qué van a hacer ustedes? What are you going to do? Look, I'm using going to. What are you going to do? Well, I have this example, other example, the sentence. Okay. He's not going to call her anymore. It's in the negative form. So you have to put it in the affirmative form, just no question form, and information question. Okay? So please, let's do the exercise. I'm going to give you some time. You can write your, your, your ideas in the chat too. In the chat, or you can say them orally. Vamos a escribir ahí. Let's think, let's think, let's make our hamsters work. ¿De cuál teacher? ¿De esa que ha puesto ahí? Sí, de esta misma. La van a poner en afirmativo, yes no question, and information question. Okay. una moto que yo por ahí con todo. Yes. <laughs> That's true. It's because I live near the road, the, the main road on the way to Los Planets. Mm. Ya. Yeah. Ahí no macito, está usted por ahí que aquel día vi el rayazo y ¡pum! quedó trabado usted. Ahí. 
quedó congelada. <risa> And where do you live, Matías? A Popa City. Ok. Let's see. Is he not going to call her anymore? Is he going to call her? Is he not? Ok, Mar. Is he going to call her? Ahí, anymore es como, negar, es como decir ya no, vea. Él ya no le va a llamar a ella. Entonces, en pregunta solo sería, is he going to call her? Solo sería así, eliminamos el anymore. Porque entonces sí sería como, le va a, a llamar ya no más. Ajá. Solo sería, is he going to call her? He's going to call her. Ajá. Y en afirmative no tendríamos que poner el anymore. Porque anymore es negativo. He's going. Ajá, he's, he's going, going to call, to call her. her anymore. No, no he's anymore. going to call her. Y ahí uh, puede decir tomorrow, eh, in the afternoon, in the evening, mm -hmm. next month, next week, etc. Or, as Alfredo says, he's going to call her again. Okay, muy bien. He's going to call her again. What is he going to call her? Ah, vaya Domingo. Ahí quizás podríamos poner, en vez de que yeah. él, porque ahí Domingo ha puesto, ¿qué va él llamarle ya no más? Ahí Domingo sería mejor, ¿por qué? Ah, o como ha puesto Fátima, when is he going to call her? ¿Cuándo le va a llamar? O why uh -huh. is he going to call her? ¿Por qué le va a llamar? ¿O por qué no le va a llamar? Why is he not going to call her? Okay. Good ideas, guys. Ok, veamos ahora la, the next sentence. Are they, it's a question. Are they going to work extra hours this weekend? Are they going to work extra hours this weekend? Ah, Fátima, muy bien. Who is going to call her? He is going to call her. Very good. Teacher, que cerquita está de la calle, teacher. No tiene miedo que le llegue una rastra por el techo. <risa> y usted como que me ha espiado y ya sabe dónde vivo. <risa> no, me que se vio ahorita una rastra que iba con todo para arriba, pero iba haciendo fuerza para subir. Es cierto. Aquí, de repente, me va a caer ah, algo baja encima. Los y ahí ustedes este, me van a decir, ven, la teacher se quedó ahí. Es un espía <risa> profesional. <risa> A professional spy man. I'm going to mute myself. Extraordinary weekend. Oh, original. In my work, no extra work. Extra work, not money. Sorry, teacher, se me fue dos veces. Are they are not? They they are. are. Mm -hmm. Lo repetí. Sorry. Then they are. Okay, they are going to work extra hours this weekend. Um, they are not going to work extra hours. They are going to work extra hours this weekend. Question, uh, information questions. Why, where, who, um, mm -hmm. 
When are they going to work extra hours? Okay, good. Okay, Matias. Acuérdense que primero va el verbo to be. When are they going to work extra hours? Y no podríamos this weekend, porque this weekend is the answer. No lo entendí. Vaya. Primero va are they. When are they going to work extra hours? Mira el, el ejemplo que ha escrito Fátima. Y no le ponga this weekend, porque entonces la respuesta es this weekend, no es la pregunta. ¿Cuándo van a trabajar ellos extra horas este fin de semana? Mm, ya, 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 ya. This weekend. <ríe> ok. Este, este fin de semana. Another could be why. Why are they going to work extra hours this weekend? Who are not going to work extra hours this weekend? Could be other possible questions. No more chats? No more chats. Mm, qué tacaños están hoy con sus participaciones en el chat. This, this Friday. Yeah, and, and, and? <laughs> and what's sleep. the problem? He sleep. Dream bird. <laughs> Who is going to work extra hours? Very good. My daily, you did. My daily, I don't remember your phrase. <laughs> it's because you, <laughs> you always have your camera off. Sorry, teacher. Tal vez la otra semana, la última. Yeah, maybe that day I can meet No, nunca la he visto, por eso no la recuerdo. Okay. Now, guys, I have a listening exercise. Okay? And then, after the listening exercise, uh, you are going to uh, select the correct option to the, I mean, the select, select the correct answer to the question. <laughs> Miren la pregunta de Alfredo. Why am I going to rest all weekend? Oh, because you deserve it or because you're sick. Why, Alfredo? Good. So I'm going to play, guys, the, the, the listening part. Just It's just that it's in my USB and I don't have it right here. <laughs> I have to go and take it. So meanwhile, you can take a look. I'm going to go and get it, but please take a look at, take a look at the screen. Maybe you can take a screenshot. Okay, give me a minute. Oh, I guess it took me less than a minute. Oh, there are more chats. Let me see the chats. Tan, 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 tan. Chats, chats. When are they going to work extra hours? Pero no pondríamos this weekend. Porque esa sería la respuesta. Vamos a ver, Alfredo dice, Why am I going to rest on weekend? Because I'm sick. Oh, poor Alfredo. <laughs> why are you why are you getting sick? Aunque se ande enfermando, pues quién lo manda a enfermarse, Alfredo. Toda la semana está enfermo. All week long. Just kidding. Just kidding, Alfredo. But we appreciate that you have connected to the classes even though you are sick. You have been participating in the next grade. That shows that you are very responsible, as all my students are. OK, 
Okay, guys, so just let me play the, the listening. Oh. Alfredo dice, ah, COVID has attacked me. Wow, Alfredo, I'm so sorry for that. Be safe, please. Híjole. Ay, I forgot, I'm not sharing the screen. <laughs> I'm sorry, how are you going to listen to it if I, have not if I am not sharing the screen or the, or the audio? Okay, give me a second. Give me another second, guys. Ay, que están chateando, mira, really? That's good that you're practicing your English. I like that. Let me know if you can listen into, if you can listen. No se escucha nada, teacher. No, no se escucha. No. Vale, vamos a ver si hoy, tal vez hoy. Vamos a ver, vamos a intentar. Let's try, let's try. Bueno, me tenemos. William dice, no se escucha. We cannot hear, teacher, we can't hear. Pero ¿cómo, pero cómo se escribe? No se escucha. Diste no. No. Nada. No. Nothing. Va, entonces lo voy a mandar al WhatsApp. Sí, ella lo puso bien chivo, Tichi. <ríe> sí, ahí lo voy a poner en el WhatsApp. Primer. Don't remember. Y ahí tú. Este es otro, igual. Ahí. No me sale, mire. Bueno, vamos a ver. Ah. Mm. I am sleeping. Okay, it's now learning your WhatsApp. I'm gonna play it too. I'm gonna play it here so that you can hear. And at the same time, you can see the screen. So nice. Coming to town. Heather, when is your brother getting into town? On Thursday at 8 o'clock in the evening. Are you going to do anything together at night? No, I think he'll be too tired and will probably just want to go to bed early. That's true. It's a long flight from Melbourne. I am so looking forward to having him here. How long is he going to stay? Only till Monday. Then he goes to Boston to see our parents. Great. So what about Friday? What are you going to do? Do you have any special plans? You bet. He can relax in the apartment on Friday morning, and then in the afternoon, we are going to the beach with some of my friends to have a picnic. I hope the weather is sunny for you. So do I. And then, in the evening? 
I'm going to take him to Domingo's, that Mexican restaurant on 7th Avenue. Do you know it? Yeah, but I thought it was very difficult to book a table there. Not if you know one of the waiters, it isn't. Then, on Saturday morning, we are going to go to the Metropolitan Museum. They've got an exhibition I know Terry will be really interested in. And then we are having lunch in Central Park before doing a bit of shopping. It seems strange to come all the way back from Australia to do some shopping. Yes, I know, but there are some things he wants to buy. I'm meeting you guys on Saturday evening at 8 o'clock, right? Oh, yes, of course. The party is at Claire's house. Come round here just before 8 and we can take a cab over to Claire's together. All right. My brother's leaving early on Monday, so Sunday will be his last day with me. We are driving up to the lakes first thing, and we are fishing all day on Sunday. It will be just like when we were young. When we come back to the city, I have one extra surprise for him before he leaves the next day. Oh, tell me what it is. Okay, but promise not to say anything to him. We're going to see a basketball game. It was so difficult to find tickets, but I got them. It's going to be a great weekend. That sounds wonderful. Okay. Could you hear clearly? No, Again. Okay. Again. Hey, Heather. When is your brother getting into town? On Thursday at 8 o'clock in the evening. Are you going to do anything together that night? No, I think he'll be too tired and will probably just want to go to bed early. That's true. It's a long flight from Melbourne. I am so looking forward to having him here. How long is he going to stay? Only till Monday, then he goes to Boston to see our parents. Great, so what about Friday? What are you going to do? Do you have any special plans? You bet, he can relax in the apartment on Friday morning and then in the afternoon, we are going to the beach with some of my friends to have a picnic. I hope the weather is sunny for you. So do I. And then in the evening? I'm going to take him to Domingo's, that Mexican restaurant on 7th Avenue. Do you know it? Yeah, but I thought it was very difficult to book a table there. Not if you know one of the waiters, it isn't. <laughs> then, on Saturday morning, we are going to go to the Metropolitan Museum. They've got an exhibition I know Terry will be really interested in. And then, we are having lunch in Central Park before doing a bit of shopping. It seems strange to come all the way back from Australia to do some shopping. Yes, I know, but there are some things he wants to buy. I'm meeting you guys on Saturday evening at 8 o'clock, right? Oh, yes, of course. The party is at Claire's house. Come round here just before 8 and we can take a cab over to Claire's together. All right. My brother's leaving early on Monday, so Sunday will be his last day with me. We are driving up to the lakes first thing and we are fishing all day on Sunday. It will be just like when we were young. When we come back to the city, I have one extra surprise for him before he leaves the next day. Oh, tell me what it is. Okay, but promise not to say anything to him. We're going to see a basketball game. It was so difficult to find tickets, but I got them. It's going to be a great weekend. That sounds wonderful. It is. Uh, yes. I have a question. Mm -hmm. uh, only eight questions. Yes, only eight questions. Do you want more questions? Mm. <laughs> no. <Okay>. No, <laughs> le entendí muy bien, DJ. <laughs> and you Either want more questions? Again. People, maybe it's because the people speak very fast. No, teacher. Se escucha por tanto. It's very hard. Lo escuchan cortado. Yo sí lo escucho bien cortado. Yo lo escucho bien, pero yo me perdí, picha. Yo, yo lo escuché, pero no. ¿A dónde se perdí? Mire, yo solo lo entendí la uno. Es que muy rápido la, hora, la, la conversación. Ellos hablan rápido. En people Ellos speak very really fast. Yeah, you have to get accustomed to that. Because American, I mean, native speakers, they speak fast. Or if you watch movies or TV programs in English, the people speak fast. Yeah? Módulo 3, teacher, somos lentos. 
<laughs> but you were going, I mean, practice, practice, and practice, practice makes master. Okay? Yes, yeah, yes. Okay, guys, now um, let's try if you could understand. What time does Heather's brother arrive in town? Seven what is the correct eight. answer? Seven Thursday. I heard Thursday uh, evening. Aha, uh -huh, Thursday evening, Thursday. but what time? Let's like, listen. Hey Heather, when is your brother getting into town? On Thursday at eight o'clock in the evening. On Thursday at eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. So the correct answer is letter D. D. Letter D. Thursday. Okay. Now, number two, where is he flying from? From London, Paris, Mexico, or Melbourne? Melbourne. Melbourne. Excellent. Melbourne. And where is Melbourne? In which country? It's in the other part of the world, in, the, in another side of the world. Go to a restaurant. Australia. Oh. Melbourne is in Australia. Okay, what are they going to do on Thursday evening? Restaurant. Go to a restaurant. Go to a restaurant. On Thursday evening. He's coming on Thursday evening at 8 p.m. Stay at home. Stay at home because she said that he's probably be very tight he's probably very tight that day listen are you going to do anything together that night no i think he'll be too tired and will probably just want to go to bed early that and, and probably he will like just go to bed early so they are going to stay at home mm. okay number four how long is terry going to stay with her two weeks until friday until monday or a week until friday Listen. That's true. It's a long flight from Melbourne. I am so looking forward to having him here. How long is he going to stay? Only till Monday. Then he goes. Until, Until Monday. Monday. Until Monday. Hey. Hey. What are the plans for Friday afternoon? Picnic at the beach. At the beach. Wow, you could, I mean, you got it correctly. What is a Mexican restaurant? Seven Avenue. Excellent, it's on Seventh Avenue. What are they going to have lunch on Saturday? Or yes, yeah. In the movie. No, in the Japanese restaurant. No, listen to Boston to see our parents. Great. So, what about Friday? What are you going to do? Do you have any special plans? You bet. He can relax in the apartment on Friday morning, and then in the afternoon, we are going to the beach with some of my friends to have a picnic. I hope the weather is sunny for you. So do I. And then in the evening. I'm going to take him to Domingo's, that Mexican restaurant on 7th Avenue. Do you know it? Yeah, but I thought it was very difficult to book a table there. Not if you know one of the waiters it isn't. Then, on Saturday morning, we are going to go to the Metropolitan Museum. They've got an exhibition I know Terry will be really interested in. And then we are having lunch in Central Park before doing a bit of shopping. What are they going to have lunch on Saturday? In the museum. No. In Central Park. In Central Park. Okay. In the morning, they are going to an exhibition in the museum. But for lunch, they are going to have lunch in Central Park. Okay? 
And what surprise does Heather have for her brother? A basketball match, a party, a fishing trip, or meeting a famous uh, person? Uh, uh, a basketball, basketball match. A basketball, basketball match. Oh, you see, match. you could get it. Even though the people speak very fast, you could understand, let's say, like 80% of the conversation or 70%. Mm -hmm. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, it's not that bad. I mean, it's good. You're beginners. Okay. To Time to work. You are going to make a short conversation similar to the one found on exercise two, making a hotel reservation. Use vocabulary from services and grammar learned in the previous and actual lesson. The vocabulary that we learned yesterday from the services like air conditioning, Wi-Fi, cable TV, backup, a laundry service, 24-hour room service, etc. And the grammar, what is the grammar that we learned today? No model. Grammar structure that we learned today is the use of be going to. Be going to be plus the base of board. Exactly. So you use the grammar to be going to. Plus the vocabulary would like, I need to, or I want to, to make a one minute conversation, booking a hotel reservation. So you're going to work in pairs, okay? You're going to create a conversation and then you're going to present it in front of the class. Um, here I put some expressions or questions that you might hear in a hotel at the front desk as a receptionist, for example. Do you have any rooms available for today? Is breakfast included? Does the room have air conditioning? Where can I check in? Can I see the room, please? Can someone help me with my bags? Could I have a wake up call at seven o'clock, please? Is there an airport shuttle bus? Oh, the shuttle service is another one. Are you ready, guys? No. Okay, no se duerman. <laughs> okay, I'm going to uh, assign you in. Mm -hmm. Let me see. How many participants? Oh, we have 19. Guys, you need to enter the rooms. Nancy, Marlon, Alba, William.
Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Hello, teacher. How is it going? Um, we make the conversation with Domingo. First, oh. first is uh, to um, two sentences, and after is the the conversation. Okay. It's similar to the one that, that we that you practice in front of the class, right? The majestic color. The golden. Golden, right? Uh, yeah, and you have to change your names and also the services and the going to question. Okay. Is it is this is the calling the golden golden star of hell? Yes. Golden, golden star of hell. Yes, that one. Perfecto. Se repite el eco. Okay. Ahí se las he mandado para que. I already I sent it in the WhatsApp group, so you have the idea. Okay, or what you have to do. Okay. And the things that you have to change. Mm, yes. Eh. Ah. Uh, Marco, yo he No sé si lo tomamos para avanzar bastante y hacer un poco más rápido. Tomamos sí, casi el mismo ejemplo. El mismo ejemplo de la, de, 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 la, de, de la conversación. Sí, si querés, te, te escribo la conversación en el chat para que la vayas teniendo también. Ah, ok. Hello, Karina. Hello, Marlon. Hello. Okay, are you working on the conversation? Yes, teacher. It's just that the internet is horrible, so we are writing everything in the chat. You are writing on the chat? Yes. Oh, I now can see it. Alfredo says, yes, it would be a pleasure to take your reservation. Okay, guys, thank you. Continue practicing, okay? Thank you, Chair. Aha, Kawai. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? Ah, okay. No, si sería yeah, si usted me dice. Aha. Single, okay. single one, please. Aha, Kawai. A single room, please. Single room. Room. <laughs> Sí, no, no, please. Y ahí me puede preguntar qué otro servicio, ¿verdad? 
Ajá. Yo le pregunté, le puedo preguntar, what do you need in the room? Do you need Wi-Fi? Hello, Rocío. Hello, teacher. Okay, are you working with um, William? With anyone. <laughs> no, because I talked to him, but he didn't uh, respond. Okay. Yes. He didn't reply. Okay, um, okay, I'm gonna assign you to another group. Okay, okay, thank you, teacher. Recuerdo que lo que hace un ratito y se me volvió a olvidar. Teacher, have a question. Yes, Matías. What, what, what do you say until? Bastante. ¿Qué significa? What does it mean? Um, yes. Hasta. Hasta. Oh, ok. Hasta. Siempre me olvida. Eh. Mm. Le puedo poner, I'm going to stay from... Sunday to Saturday. From sun hmm? from Sunday to Saturday. Okay, from one Sunday to the next Saturday, like one yes. week. Okay, yeah. Yes. From Sunday to Saturday, yeah. Así será. I am going to stay from Monday. From Sunday to stay. From, yeah, from, you said from, from Sunday to Saturday. That means Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Huh? Sunday, the domingo, uh, al Saturday. One week. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Sí, pero como llegamos domingo, tengo que decirle del domingo, ¿ah? ¿eh? Desde el domingo hasta el viernes, hasta el sábado, ¿ah? ¿eh? O va, desde el domingo a sábado, a viernes, pongámosle, va, para que no sea una semana. ¿eh? <risa> ok. It's your, it's up to you. <risa> ok, I'll, be, I'll go and check other group, ¿ok? Ok. Sí. From Sunday. I go to stay. <risa> I go What? What service are you looking for? I would like to... My, my question is, what service are you looking for? What services? What services? I would like to to have a to have a Wi-Fi internet or a Wi-Fi connection. I would like to have um, cable TV. We have and also uh, 
à laundry service. The service we have is um, free parking, telephone, bath, tub, and shower. <laughs> <laughs> Floor, floor roof, cable TV, and accept credit card. And you say a special room or single room? Uh huh. Special. Special room. Please. Okay. Okay, I think that um are are you ready guys? Um so so <laughs> um one minute more. Okay. One, One minute. minute. One minute. Special room, please. Okay. Ahí, este, solo agreguémosle what time to, what hour you arrive. Yes, guys, there are only four minutes before 10 p.m. Yes, guys, you could make it. Congratulations, you could finish another week of classes. So now I would like to have, I would like to have you presenting your conversations and then we are going to end the class. Okay, so who would like to be the first ones? Marco and Domingo. Okay, perfect. Go ahead, guys. All right. You ready, Domingo? You ready? You? Me too. Okay, I begin. Oh. Hello. Thank you for calling. Thank you for calling the beer hotel. This Marco, how can I help you? Hello, I need you to make, make a reservation. Sure. Uh, may I have your name, please? I, uh, sure. I am Domingo Gonzalez. Thank you, Mr. Gonzalez. When are you going to arrive? I am going to arrive uh, to tomorrow. Tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, all right. Tomorrow morning. Uh, 
How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gonzalez? I am going to stay with the tomorrow. Only tomorrow, okay. Yes. Are you going to make a reservation, a single or a special room? Uh, a, uh, a special room, please. What hour do you arrive? Are you read a excuse me when are you going to arrive when arrive. are you going to arrive when, when? Uh, es que we are going to arrive en este le estoy preguntando a qué horas llegaría porque es de solo un día Yeah, but <laughs> what time are you going to arrive? A que hora va a llegar? What time mm -hmm. are you going to arrive? I I a club a o'clock a o'clock tomorrow. Thank you for prefer. Okay. Thank, thank you. you for your preference. Very good. Okay. Thank you. Next. Bueno, si no, no nos vamos a ir hasta que todos pasen. Con Walter. ¿Qué hay, Matías, en Walter? Yes. Ah. You ready, Walter? El último empujoncito. You ready? Walter is there. Hello. <laughs> Hello, thank you for, for calling the Majestic Paradise Hotel. This is Walter. How can I help you? Hello. I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Matias Ramirez. Thank you, Mr. Ramirez. When are you going to arrive? Uh, I'm going to arrive to arrive on August Sunday 11th. How long are you going to stay with you, Mr. Ramirez? Uh, I'm going to stay from Sunday to Saturday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single room? Uh, no, I need a family room, please. If we have a family room. Uh, if that family room is excellent, thank you. Thank you for your prefer. Only okay, that excellent, good job. Uh, only one observation, Walter. When you ask how long are you going to stay with us? Okay, with us. Okay, the pronunciation of us. Okay, good. Next, Marlon group. Okay, teacher. I was with Karina, but everything it was written. Karina, are you there? Written, sorry. Yes, but I mean, you can read the conversation or not with Karina. Because I, I know Alfredo can't, but. Karina. The conversation, Karina. <laughs> OK. 
Okay, another group then. Uh, volunteers. Mauricio, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Um, hello, thank you for calling to Sheraton Hotel. This is Carla. How can I help you? Uh, good night. I need a reservation for Monday at 10 o'clock. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Mauricio Mahano. Thank you, Mr. Mahano. How long are you going to stay? I am going to stay from Monday to Tuesday. Okay, would you like uh, to make the reservation for a single or a double room? Uh, a single room, please. Uh, what additional service do you need? Services do you need? I need a uh, valet parking, Wi-Fi, laundry. Okay, thank you for your preference. Thank you so much, guys. That was a great conversation. Thank you, everybody, for um, participating, for um, working. Uh, with your partner, I know that you've been working and that you have your conversations, but because of the time, we cannot listen to all of them, okay? But it was a pleasure, guys, to see you this evening. I had a fantastic time with you today, and I hope that you enjoy your weekend, that you can have your plans. Um, Marlon, please take a shower. It's important on Sunday. On Sunday, it's it's the day for you to take a shower. <laughs> Absolutely, <Yes>. teacher. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that would be your homework. Guys, uh, I don't know if you have any questions. I would like you to um, to practice the, the use of going to. I sent in the WhatsApp group a, a link where um, you can find more exercises, okay? Because I think it's important for you to practice. Okay, guys, um, have a good night. See you on Monday. See you. I am sorry. Thank you, Nancy. I need to take the attendance. Yes, thank you so much for reminding me. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I you see the teacher is sometimes, you know, despistada. You're running. Eh, Alba. <laughs> <laughs> Alba is not here. Yeah. Sleeping. Oh, Alfredo, present. Carla Sánchez, present. Carlos Gualberto, present. Teacher. Cristina, Domingo, present. Fátima, ya se fue a dormir, she went to sleep. Present. Ah, no, she <laughs> said, <laughs> Matías Lemos, <laughs> Karina. Present, present, teacher. Present. Marco. Present. Marlon. Present. Mauricio. Present. Maideli. She said present? Yo creo que dijo present en el chat. Ah, ok, 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 ok. Uh, next, um, Salvador Edgardo, hoy no se conectó, ¿verdad? Sandra present, David, Victor David present, Walter Daniel not present, just kidding, I know he's there, Walter, Daniel, yo creo que se salió teaching, vaya salió, cuando, dijo, cuando te dijo el, <laughs> cuando le dije adiós, happy salió. Monday, sí Monday, sí Monday, Dios mío, pero se yo estaba, a darle estaba click, con iba, el tío. dedito en salir, William Eduardo. Vaya, hoy sí, pues ya. William Eduardo. Ahí estaba también, ¿verdad? De oyente. Ok, guys. Have a good night. I'm so sorry that I took more, more minutes. Rocío, teacher, please. 
I'm sorry, I didn't get it. Ay, no, I'm sorry. Katia. Okay. Es lipe, dice. Necesita <laughs> drink <laughs> coffee before class, <laughs> teacher. I did it, I did it. Nancy, listen. To water. <laughs> to glass. Rocío. <laughs> Okay, I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. It's just to see if you are awakened. <laughs> Bye. Good luck, coffee. Bye. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Hello, Matías. Hola. <risa> hey, teacher, y al final, nadie, no, no, no pasaron todo, ¿verdad? No, por el tiempo. No, yo le digo, este, con los 10 minutos. Mm, pero todavía faltan tres días. Ah. Bueno, Digo William. Que ya estuvo una vez. Sí, William dijo que ibas. De ahí todo no, ha pasado subía. una vez. Esa es la primera vez que se va a repetir. Usted, usted. Porque mm. William dijo que, lo, que donaba sus 10 minutos. Sí, sí no, pues sí, sí. Practice. Ok, let's practice. Um, what are you going to do tomorrow, Matías? Tell me specific mm. things that you have planned to do tomorrow. Or you can ask me questions. Okay. Um, I wake up. I am the, going to wake up at. Okay. I'm going to wake up at in 7 p.m. At 7 a.m. Uh, breakfast. Okay. I'm going to I'm going to have breakfast. I'm going to have breakfast and 8 a.m. and I'm going to drive at my work. Yes. Okay. And hey, working. In the morning. <laughs> okay. What time are you going to finish work? And twelve o'clock. Oh, okay, twelve midday. Okay, good. And um, I'm going to write uh, visit my. Old from oh yes, and I'm going to visit my mother hmm. and and my mother-in-law. Okay, I I and guess they are gonna be very happy to see you. It is a sick her. She is sick. Yes. Your mother-in-law. Her. Yes. Okay, yeah. yeah. Be yeah. careful. Sí. Eh, is all is eight, 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 eighty eight. old. She's eighty, 80 old. Eighty years old. Ochenta. She's 80 uh, years old. Yes. She's 80 years old. Okay. She's 80 uh -huh. years old. Uh -huh. She's 80 years old. Mm -hmm. um, hey, I'm going to drive uh, my home. Okay. Wow. Yeah. You're, you're going to have a, a very interesting day because you're going to visit your relatives. You're gonna see your son, your mother, your mother-in-law. Yeah, that mean that's gonna be great. Driving. <laughs> Driving. And okay, and you're going to ride your motorbike. 
You're more yes, a psycho. Yes, yes. yes. And only that. And on Sunday, what about Sunday? And Sunday, and I am going to wake up at 10 a.m. <gasps> yes. Okay. Yes. It's Great Sunday. for you. <laughs> it's Sunday. It's Sunday. And lunch. 2 p.m. <laughs> You're gonna have lunch at 2 p.m. Okay. <laughs> yes. Uh, I I can. I can play video game. <laughs> um. I going to visit my my brother or my cousin. Okay. Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. That's it. Or relax every after. In the afternoon, the whole afternoon. The afternoon. Yes. Okay, that sounds nice. Um, I'm going to wake up at 7 a.m. tomorrow um, and I'm going to have my, my breakfast. I have to clean the house. I have to do the laundry. And also I teach Bible classes in the morning, so I'm going to do that until 11. Then I have to prepare lunch. I'm going to have my meeting my meeting in the congregation in the afternoon from three to five and then my boyfriend is going to pick me up and we are going to visit my mother and my brother is going to make a barbecue for dinner so we're going to have dinner together with my family my boyfriend and then i'm going to stay with my mother i'm going to sleep there with my with my parents and on sunday um i'm going to be with my mom <laughs> <laughs> yeah I, I i i will probably help her with the with the cleaning and with mm. the lunch mm -hmm. ah and i'm gonna do I, i'm gonna do the laundry there <laughs> <laughs> yes okay okay yeah we are already busy people mm -hmm. Mm. so matthias uh, do you have any other question about today's topic or any other one? No, teacher. Okay. No. No. Ahí estamos. Hoy sí, vea. Okay. Ya va agarrando la onda. Ah, yo sí. <laughs> no, sí, 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 hoy sí. O sea, fíjese que con la profesora anterior ella habló bastante en español. Y yo creo que eso hacía que casi no le entendiera mucho, o sea, sí le entendía, porque le entendía, pero hay cosas que se me han quedado más con usted, por el hecho de que siempre está hablando en inglés. Okay. Ajá, o sea, eh, ajá, o sea eh, eso yo he sentido, eso, 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 esa diferencia la he sentido, porque la he sentido, o sea, en un módulo creo que he avanzado casi con lo que avancé en los primeros dos módulos. Ajá, o, obvio, lo que, lo que en el primer módulo y en el segundo módulo ya capaz, prácticamente que ya lo sabía, lo que estudié en bachillerato, de noveno, de séptimo bachillerato, entonces, este, pero sí, ya lo último, lo show, eh, lo que yo decía, lo de Wall, Wall You Mind, and Call You, Call, Call, Call You, call you ajá, este, esos, ya no los habían dicho, pero yo no los había entendido muy bien. Porque yo pensaba de que could you, eh, would you mind, eh, el verb, era igual. Uh -huh. Pensaban que era en forma base siempre. Uh -huh. Ajá, entonces ahí me, me, me esclareció, o sea, sentí una gran iluminación ahí. <risa> <risa> sí, porque yo ahí, ahí estaba yo bastante corto. Ahora yo, yo si se fijó ayer, yo, yo vi bastante, entendí lo que ella es el... Eh, could you mind, could you, could you, y would you mind. Uh -huh. Ajá, and 
y should. Ok. Sí, estoy, estoy bastante bien ahorita. Vamos a ver cómo nos va en el siguiente módulo. Mm, we're going to do it great. Sí, sí. A ver cuánto es varios. Varios se van a ir de los que estamos porque Karina dice de que ya la despidieron. Dice. Entonces solo va a terminar este módulo. Ahí me estaba diciendo. Y no sé si a Maideli le van a aceptar por el hecho de que casi no ha estado en las clases porque no tenía COVID. Y, y ahorita que también le dio COVID a... Alfredo. Alfredo. ¿y qué, Yo creo qué? que Salvador también ha estado, porque me mandó la incapacidad y, y aunque no dice COVID, pero sí dice proceso febril y caringitis aguda, viral. Bueno, de Entonces, veras. Entonces sí ha estado malito. Ojalá que, que, que les tome en cuenta de que Alfredo sí ha estado participando a pesar de la gran dificultad, sí. pero ha estado participando, ¿verdad? Y Salvador se ha conectado, ¿verdad? Aunque sea ahí. Yo... De vez en cuando yo vi que se ha estado conectando, pero pero a ver si le van a tomar en cuenta eso, ¿verdad? Porque como dicen de que tenemos que estar al 80% de las eso clases, sí. de las horas. Entonces, eso y, sí, y, eso, y eso, o sea, haciendo la cuenta, uno solo puede faltar a dos clases nomás. Uh -huh. O sea, eso es todo lo que uno puede faltar. Y bueno, yo hasta ahorita no he faltado. Aquel día que, que estuve, estaba trabajando, en los ratitos paraba la máquina y podía hablar un poquito, pero de ahí tenía que darle marcha a la máquina. Y si la máquina está en marcha, créame, no me escuchan nada. Uh -huh. Ajá, entonces de ahí, por eso es que yo, no, de ahí me vine, cuando ya vine ya pude, bueno, prácticamente solo encendí la compu, me pasé a la compu y ya, ya, ya se acabó la clase. <risa> Pero igual, el siguiente día vi, vi completo también. Ah, la clase. eso está muy bien. Sí, okay. para poder que, que captar, no quedar perdido. Sí, no quedar perdido. Mm -hmm. That's good. Congratulations. Sí. Keep on the good work. Keep up the good work. Yes. <laughs> okay, Matías. Rest okay. and have a pleasant night. Okay. Bye. 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 Enjoy your weekend. Gracias, igual. Thank <laughs> you.